Okay, so to install it, all you have to do is have Jetpack installed, which pretty much comes by default. If you don't have it installed, then you can go to Plugins, Add New, type in Jetpack, search, and it'll say Jetpack by WordPress, and then you can just install it. Uh, once that's installed, this this one feature in here, like I said, the extra sidebar widgets is automatically going to be enabled, and it's automatically going to put all four of these extra sidebar widgets into your widget section. So we're going to show you how to use the image widget to put an image in your sidebar. So to go to do that, first of all, you go to your widgets, appearance widgets in the back end. I have my main sidebar here. I just delete this real quick. Show you how to put this in. Okay, so all you have to do to to put this into your sidebar, and I'll show you my sidebar right now. As you can see, no image on top. I have a subscribe button there right now, or a subscribe widget uh, using the text widget. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to drag image jetpack over there. Okay, so here are the fields that I need to fill out. You can give it a widget title. I'm going to just say image title right now so you can see what that looks like. Okay, image URL. For this, you need to go to your media tab. You need to upload an image. So I'm going to click add new. I'm just going to drag an image over to it and upload it. I'm going to click edit so that I can come in here and grab the file URL. And I'm just going to click copy. Look at that big old fake catfish. Okay, so now we're going to come back to our uh, image jetpack widget that we're installing and for the image URL I'm going to paste in the link to that uh, URL. So you can either paste in the full link or you can just cut out your URL if you want it to stay relative. If you want alternate text to come up in case somebody's image doesn't load, I'm going to put crazy catfish picture. So that's what's going to come up if there's text. You can put catfish title there for the title catfish caption. And I might not have all this stuff styled because I'm just using a WordPress 2012 theme right now. You can click the alignment to either left, center, or right align it. I'm going to, let's just right align it for the moment. And then you can say, uh, you can specify a width and height, or if empty, they're going to try and determine the size. Now I did pick out a picture that's more wide than my sidebar is, so we're gonna see what happens when they do that. And the, the link URL is where you want them to uh, be forwarded to if they click on that picture. So this makes it a clickable link when they click on it. I'm going to click save, go back to my site and refresh. Okay. And you can see that it did manage to resize it, which is pretty cool. You put in my image title. It looks like I didn't have caption style, but you can see that the, ti the title does come up when I hover over it. Um, so if I needed to style the captions let's see ah, okay so I didn't even put the caption in there once I once I put the caption in that's interesting so this field right here didn't seem to go anywhere so that's interesting um, well for whatever reason it didn't put the caption out there it's not a matter of it not being styled on my theme it's just it didn't put it out there so that's something to note. Caption didn't do anything. So I can take that out. Uh, let's see. It, it didn't need to align it right because it shrunk it to fit. I think that if this was an even smaller picture, let's see how big this is. So it's 400 by 300. So if I made this 100 by 66, we could play with the alignment. So I'm just going to change the, the width and height to 100 by 66 so we can see if the alignment's working. Okay, and you can see that it did change the size and it did align it differently. So we'll do left align now. Yep, just like that. And if I need to take it, take those specified heights out to make it look right again, and I can do that, click refresh. Okay, so you can see it's it's not very difficult to put an image in here. If I click on it, it's gonna take me to Google, which is where I told it to click on it, if I make that a clickable link. The other thing that you can do is you can take out the title under the widget title, I believe. Let's just click refresh and see if it takes out that image title. Yeah, okay, so it did. So, I mean, you, you don't have to have a title if you don't want to. You can put a title in there if you want. You can make this clickable link. You can easily align it left, right, or center. You can change the size. And that's how you install, or that's how you use, rather, the Jetpack image widget in your sidebar. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, go ahead and click like, and then click the link below to sign up for our newsletter where we'll send you guides, reviews, and how-tos directly to you, as well as our free guide on how to make money with your WordPress site.